Now drive. We're going to this destination. Listen, lady. I ain't the criminal version of Uber. After us? Get rid of them. I'll make sure they don't. Come. Are you crazy? Actually, don't answer that. This just went to 11 real fast. You are so concerned about the lives of those police officers. Perhaps you are one as well. Me? A cop? Hell no. How about I show you my prison task from back in Barstow later? If there is a later. Keep throwing those things out the window, and we'll have a whole damn city looking for it. You have another way to start this? Actually, I do. Next level James Bond shit. Maybe you'll pass these tests after all. Boss Hoss man can throw all the tests he wants at me. I've been rolling with you guys for months now. I got this. You don't always have your fancy gadgets, but at least now I know you can improvise. Get rid of the rest of them. Adios, suckers. Double or nothings. We're losing them. We're here. Wait. What are you doing? Up ahead. I hope you're gonna leave me a big tip after that. I assume I passed then? You talk too much. We're still on for drinks later, right? Mr. Pierce, I heard you ran into some trouble with the local law enforcement. Oh, was that what I saw in my rear view? I was going too fast to notice.
Then it appears you're exactly the driver we need for a rather delicate operation. You know I'm the only man for the job, right? Did you ever order something online, only to never have it appear on your doorstep? Ah, sure. That sucks, man. Immensely frustrating. Especially if it's something you specifically wanted and you can't have it just because some idiot screwed up on the delivery. Fortunately, there is a replacement. One that will satisfy my requirements after some adjustments. Right, right on, man. Are you up to the task, Mr. Pierce? Does fast food cure a hangover? <laughs> Good luck, Mr. Pierce. My son Kai will give you the details. Oh, wait. This is your pops? It's Roman. Okay. I got a top secret mission. And I'm gonna need two things. What's that? First, some cars. I mean, serious cars. Okay, what else? I'm gonna need some kind of signal scrambler, because what they want me to steal can never be turned on. Armstrong found himself another Eclipse device. I've been thinking of a way to jam it. Leave it with me. Yeah, the big boss man was pretty upset that his son Kai lost the first one. Wait. Did you say Kai? Yeah. Kai is Armstrong's son? And you saw him tonight? Saw him? I could have reached out and smacked him. Huh. What are we waiting for? First, we meet up with Dom. is what I'm talking about. Hey, what's up? Deja vu. Maybe this is where our luck turns around. How did you find out about this race? Every city, every town in America has got a race. Tell me again why Interpol can't just give us some cars. Roman's supposed to be this lone wolf wheelman. They expect him to find his own rights. So where are they? Dominic Toretto! Welcome to the Big Easy. Mahalia, I got a business proposition for you. Anything for a legend like you. We need some cars. Ah, uh, that I can't do. Look, Dom, what's mine is yours. But this whole thing is legit. I've heard the rumors of what you do with cars nowadays. And I can't have it traced back to me or what we built here. Great. So what do we do now? What we do best. Respectfully, nobody in their right mind would consider going up against you in this race. True. But I'm not going to be the one behind the wheel. This is no amateur event, sweetheart. What'd you bring? 500 kilowatts, 750 horsepower, and 0 to 60 in 2.8 seconds fast enough for you? Sweetheart? Fair enough. We'll see if your sleeper car can keep up with these. Ladies! Gentlemen! And everyone in between! 
between. Today, you are all racers. Winner takes all. And as you can see, these prizes are exquisite. Two laps around this fine city of ours. Keep it between the barriers and give the crowds a show that will go down in history. Drivers, you better be ready. This is the ride of your life. On my mark. Don't embarrass me in front of these gas guzzlers. Gotta use all the track here. Thread each apex. I'm smaller and more agile than those beasts. I can do this. Go, second lap.
sector of the lap now. Gotta bring it home. Come on, don't let me down now. Gotta show Dom who was right to put his faith in me. I'm gonna do it! Last few corners. Focus! Where'd you find Cam, anyway? You know, I'm realizing now... I think they found me. I was ten. They were a few years younger. They were new to the neighborhood. And their parents constantly left them alone. And one night... I caught them trying to get into my house. They were scared. They... I just wanted someone to play with. What did you do? I guess I could have yelled from my parents. But they were crying. So he just played, talked about cars. And after that, we hung out all the time. We've been through a hell of a lot together. What about their parents? Let's grab the pinks for the cars. Dom's probably halfway to Roman with the scrambler by now. the cars for Roman now. I'll send you the coordinates. I'll see you back at base. kind of exposed out here, you know what I'm saying? It's hard to be all undercover out here in the open. I'm three minutes out. Okay, man, I'm at the old theme park.
Talk to me, Roman. No, man, I'm good, I swear. I mean, I've already been pushed out of a plane. I've already been harpooned and damn near drowned, which means I'm pretty down for anything, right? When in doubt, do what I do. I've seen what you do. That's why I'm kind of terrified. We'll have eyes on you the whole time. Kicking back with drinks while you watch me splatter my brains all over the place. Yeah, I feel better already. Maybe you've been undercover so long you've forgotten who you are. And who's that? Roman Pierce, who drives with the best crew in the world. <laughs> That's right, I am. <laughs>